Recently, HasLab created this incredible replica of Jabba's sail barge through a crowdfunding effort. How cool would it be to recreate the scene from Return of the Jedi and blow one of them up? So that's exactly what we're going to do. Otherwise, it would just be laundry day. I know when I have eight to 10 messages waiting for me that all have the same thing in it, <laughs> that something has happened while I've slept or that I missed the day before. Uh, apparently, the official Star Wars YouTube channel called The Star Wars Show um, took it upon themselves to take a HasLab Hasbro sail barge and blow it up. Uh, they were doing this to recreate the original effect shot from Return of the Jedi when the sail barge explodes as our heroes get away on the skiff. And people just were like, oh my God, Michael, you gotta check this out. And they're not wrong. I mean, I understand why they're <laughs> reaching out to me to ask me about this. Um, on, on the one hand, you know, whoever owns it gets to do with the item whatever they want. You know, if I wanted to, I could take my entire toy collection or movie collection or wardrobe and put it out in the backyard and burn it if I wanted to, provided that I didn't let the fire get out of control and burn down the neighbor's house. Um, so on that level, I get the fundamentals. I get it. Uh, and then there's the novelty of they were doing it for a purpose. They were doing it, they were using it as a prop, much like I use my toys and collectibles within videos. Um, you know, so they were, they were creating something with it, which kind of is the irony of a video like that. We are destroying something to create a piece of social media entertainment. All right. Um, I, I think people were asking me because of the controversy around the sail barge with retroblasting in general. Um, but I'm not a, I'm not someone who, uh, I'm not a destructive person. Uh, I don't, I don't destroy things as, as part of my, uh, part of my MO, my life MO. Um, I like to build, I like to construct, uh, I like to fix, I like to repair, um, unless I was doing a, a, an original movie, for example, I wouldn't want to blow something up. And uh, especially blow something up just to recreate something that got blown up 36 years ago. So I'm against that, just like I was against the Red Letter Media video where they melted you know, thousands of vintage Star Wars figures. Um, I was not a fan of that, that either. I, I don't think destroying stuff is effective in getting getting your message across, whatever that message is. Um, and in the case of this, for example, um, you know, this this channel is directly tied to Lucasfilm, um, I believe. So there was a lot more they could have done with that sail barge. They could have donated it uh, to a children's charity. They could have auctioned it and donated the proceeds. Uh, to a charity. Um, there was a lot they could have done that would have been far more altruistic and less sophomoric. Um, I, I don't even know if I'm using that word uh, properly in this context. Uh, it was it was rather immature, I think, to do that. Yes, they brought out the real cameras and the people that did it and the, 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 the did it on the same sound stage and blah, 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 blah. And that sounds great, but... Um, it was a collectible piece. It was a highly sought after piece. Um, and I think they knew that in the background and never explicitly said it when they decided to blow it up. I think they knew that, you know, it would be like saying, well, we've gotten our hands on um, one of the rare rocket firing Boba Fetts and we've decided to use that Boba Fett as a stand in uh, for a stunt model and throw it into a Zarlacc pit on, you know, a bottle rocket. 
um, to recreate the stunt from Return of the Jedi. And you're going, okay, well, why, why would you do that? Why wouldn't you, if you want to recreate the shot, why don't you recreate the model as well? You've got the resources. You are Star Wars. You are Lucasfilm. Why aren't you, why aren't you doing that? Um, so while I'm not, I'm still not a fan of HasLab, um, nor how Hasbro sold the barge, I was always a supporter of, of Hasbro if, if they had decided to put the barge out for normal retail. I said that. And so, so inherently, I'm not a physically destructive uh, individual. So, um, so yeah, um, it was a little odd. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm glad that the, the creators of the, of the effect, the original effect, got their credit for it. Um, you know, and got, got some time in the sun to, to be on camera and talk about, you know, the original effect and, and all that kind of stuff. I, I always enjoy that, but, um, I would have just as soon watched that in a, in a Blu-ray featurette without the, the gratuitous destruction of a, of a, of a rare item. So, um, hope that answers your question. Um, I know that's probably not the answer you were looking for, um, but uh, yeah, I mean, I, 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 I took one halfway around the world. Um, so so I, I, Brent told me I was allowed to do whatever I wanted to with it. He said, he said I could destroy it if I wanted to, so long as it would help the channel. I'm just not that guy. So, um, but yeah, um, I saw the video, some interesting information in there. Um, they could have done, they could have made a lot of different choices, could have made a number of different choices that would have been better. So, um, yeah, well, I'm working on some uh, other videos, so I'm going to get back to it. So thanks for watching this, guys. I'll talk to you later.